It was the battle of the, it was the clash of the Commonwealth here in Lynchburg, Virginia, as the Flames dropped a game to the Virginia Tech Hokies in this by a score of 13 to nine. Yeah, really well played game, hard fought game between these two Commonwealth foes. Is, you know, it was a top six matchup in the MCLA and it lived up to the hype, didn't it? I mean, really Liberty got out to a really good start. They got up early, got up a few goals. Cam Carter with a beautiful goal here to start out. It was all over the place. You had guys like Cooper Branham, Will Geary had a ton of goals today as well. But Virginia Tech came storming back and won a lot of battles chaotically. I think that was really part of the game plan today. But really the biggest part of it was for me, Faceoffs. Dan Gaffney won unofficially 17 faceoffs today. It was just an outstanding performance at the dot, and it gave Virginia Tech a lot of extra opportunities. Virginia Tech was much better off of, you know, the quick restarts, off of turnovers. There was mistakes left and right. There was controversy. There was penalties. But the team that took advantage of it at the end of the day more was the Hokies as they come away with a four-goal victory and remain undefeated in the MCLA. In upcoming games, the Liberty University Flames goes away to Colorado for a back-to-back -back series against Colorado and Colorado State on back-to-back -back games. Should be a lot of fun there, February 25th and 26th, and then a trip down south. I believe the game is in North Carolina as they take on one of the best teams in the country in Georgia Tech. Still some big foes for Liberty to beat, so they're going to have more opportunities to avenge a loss like this like they had today.